show you how to do some nice natural chocolate mousse eyeshadow. I picked up this new Maybelline quad at CVS. It was about six, seven dollars. So first you want to take the rounder side of the two sides of the brushes. You're going to stick it in the base section, the uh, pink, and you want to make sure you get enough and apply it. I apply it liberally all over my eye. You want to make sure you get the inner corner of your eye and a little bit underneath. It helps brighten it and open up your eyes a little bit more. You want to make sure they're even, and you're going to turn over the brush and use the same rounded side and you're going to stick it in the smaller section. This says it's for your lid. I apply it only to about three quarters of my lid. Now you want to take the pointed side of the brush. See the difference? You're going to stick that in the crease section. And what I always do is I stick almost the entire point on it. Instead of rubbing the entire brush. And I generally find my eye for this. You want to make sure you get it completely on the brow with about three quarters of the way. And you want to make the lopsided V. So that the longer side of the V runs around three quarters of the top of the eye. And the other side of the V is about a quarter of the way in uh, along your lash line. This helps give it a smoky effect. So again, all the way along the brow bone, three quarters of the way down, and a quarter of the way on the lash line. It also helps if you make sure that what you do is even on both sides. Now I will use two different kinds of mascaras. This is the first one. It's the XXL Pro by Nato. Uh, first, it's 24 hour bold, by the way. So it comes in two sides. First step, oops, swings it. On the second side, helps to get more, you know, intense and volume. See that spot I just got on my eye, I'll it off later. Let it dry, and then you can just use your finger and get it off. If I wipe it now, it'll just smear. Now I'm using Maybelline The Fossies Volume Express. This helps give my eyelashes more definition, and it helps me see more mobile. And I just like the length that it gives. See how they come together? Lash well, up and turn my brush up and down to fix them. That generally helps to separate them. Nothing seems to be now we're gonna wipe off that spot and you can't really use much of it. Here's the part where I put it. Whatever that left is brown uh red one eyeshadow to use as a bottom eyeliner. It's in uh, Rich Staples, by the way. I'm going to take my little eyeliner brush and I'm just going to put it brush well, three quarters a third of the way underneath my eye. By using eyeshadow instead of actual eyeliner, it helps give it a softer look. And it makes it look more natural. 
I've actually stopped using bottom eyeliner completely because I realized I don't like the way the unnatural look. Like a water This is my new lipstick that I'm brand new to today and I'm going to try this in my hair. It's in Chanel. I just want to buy it to you.